Whew. I have not vlogged in a minute. Oh. So today, um, I am doing a couple of things. I'm going to go get my blood, some blood work taken, some blood work taken, and some blood taken. Um, then I'm going to the Crystal Festival with Megan. This is very, sorry, it's very. Going to the Crystal Festival with Megan. I'm very excited. Um, I'm going to go to the shops, go to a book, book, book shop. I can't fucking talk. Um, and I was going to clean my room, not my room, clean my car, but I'm not sure if I'll have time to do that. Uh, and then I'm also going to stay at her house for the night because I need to puppy sit her puppy. So I'll try to vlog as much as I can. Okay, so I just got back to from getting my blood taken. Very easy, very fast. Um, I'm now just waiting for Megan to finish her work day. So I am going to clean my car while I wait for her. I'm not going to record it because I don't know where to put my phone. But I'm not going to do like a clean clean. I'm just going to get rid of all the shit that's in it. Um, and then when that's done, I'll hopefully be going to the Crystal Festival. Okay, so I did film a couple of videos um, while I was at the festival, the, 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 the Crystal Festival, did I say Crystal? Crystal Festival, it was awesome, I loved it. I especially liked one guy, his name was Chris, and he had Crystal something Australia. Let me find that. Chris at Quality Crystals Australia. He was awesome, loved talking to you. I introduced you under, I introduced myself to you as Talia, if you didn't know Talia is my real name, but on the internet I prefer to go as Bonnie, um, so, yeah, <laughs> um, but I'm just going to do a quick little haul video, um, it's not going to just be from the Crystal Festival, um, there's also, I went to a bookshop, so I got a couple of things from the bookshop and then I also went to my local um, spiritual shop and I just got two things from there so I'll start with the crystal festival though this little bag little, it's very heavy these two books so obviously I wanted a crystal book um, this one jumped up at, at me um, felt right the um, uh, the art is very me um, and when I flicked through it to it seemed pretty easy to understand um, while still giving a lot of um, information so I think this book will be fantastic for me it's just look at it it's amazing and I will have to use it straight away because a couple of the um, a couple of the oh my god it even has a page for um, crystal divination um, 
yeah, a couple of the stones I got, they didn't actually tell me the names of them or anything, so I'm going to have to figure it out myself. So um, that will be fun. But yeah, so this was $14.99. And I also just got this little book, um, A Little Bit of Pendulums, An Introduction to Pendulum Divinations by Denny Bryant. So I thought this was just what I needed because I do want to get into learning about pendulums. Um, so I thought it would be a cute little book for me to start reading on. This one, I can't remember how much this one was. I think it was like $9. Um, I've actually been looking at this one on um, some bookshops already, um, just like having a look at it to possibly buy it and then when I saw it I was like yeah let's get it but yes this looks like a pretty good book I'll probably read this one straight after I finish reading Witchery which is this is the current book I'm reading Witchery is the current book I'm reading at the moment it's pretty good it does have a bit of spells where I'm like eh, but um it's pretty interesting so far I've already got some tabs filled out for my um, journal so I actually got this one see I don't even know what this one was one here it was with oh god I can't remember for the life of me what this one was but it looked different to the other ones it was with and that's why I wanted it so bad because it was different now this one was $14 it says it on the thing but Chris I love you Chris um gave it to me for $10 but yeah, I th thought this one was just absolutely beautiful. It's different. Um, it has like a little chip almost on the bottom of it, but it's very beautiful. I love it. And yeah, it was different than the rest, so I really wanted it. But I can't remember what one it is, so I will figure that out. Then I got this little pendant. So clear quartz. My little pendant. So what I'm going to do, I actually have a broken necklace. I'm just going to attach this to the necklace and I'll use this as my pendulum. Uh, I can't remember how much this one was. I think it was $10. Um, yeah, it did call to me. Oh, I'm in love with this one. Again, I don't know what stone this is, but it was $15 and it came on a little, whoop, a little sitter and it's just gorgeous looks like some kind of like I want to say opalite but then I feel like that's not right but that's what I want to say but it's just beautiful it's not rose quartz because it's got too much of an iridescent to it but it's a sphere it's absolutely gorgeous all right so this one I actually know what it's called it is a rhyolite this one was actually in a lucky dip um it was three dollars for a lucky dip and I was like hell yeah I'll do that shove my hand in it to pick anyone and this is the one I got very different definitely not something that I would like go and get that's why I do like it because it's like it's almost like it chose me in a way and I've got this oh, Chris this is another one from Chris from quality crystals Australia stand um, he gave me this free little um, clear quartz heart just absolutely darling it is so beautiful. I love it. Um, and then I bought this blue agate heart. It's just gorgeous. They did have bigger ones, but I don't really love big, big stones. I like the more like small stones. Um, I think this is the only one that really yelled at me that was big. Oh. Oh, so this is a keychain. So I'll be popping this onto my keys. This is just a clear quartz keychain. The lady there made it herself. Um, clear quartz doesn't say how much it was. $10 it was. I thought this was really cute. I actually got two keychains because funny enough, straight after I bought these keychains, I've been like, Tell myself to get more keychains, which is weird. Who just tells himself, all right, I need a new keychain. Um, straight after I bought them, I got into my car and my current keychain broke. So now I have a new keychain, lucky. This one is another one from Chris at uh, Quality Crystals. This is actually for one of my friends because she told me that she loves 
um, rose quartz. Um, it is a rose quartz love heart. I'm going to be giving it to her for Christmas um, with a little sleep kit thing from Dusk. So I thought that would be really cute. When I saw this, I instantly thought of her. Ah, uh, this one. <laughs> Again, I don't know what this one is. I'm going to have to figure it out myself. But it is this crystal black skull. It's just absolutely gorgeous. This was only $15, I want to say. It's just gorgeous. And this was like one of the first things that I went towards because I was like, I need that. I need that. And it's got a fair bit of weight to it too. I love it. I already have one crystal skull, which is a tiger's eye. So yeah, I love it. So that is all of my crystals from the crystal festival. Um, I'm going to put them on my altar, but I'm not going to cleanse them until the next full moon. I might just sit them around my selenite until then though. But, um, the energy um but yeah i'm really happy with what i got there it's gonna be kind of fun trying to figure out what a couple of them are i don't need to figure out what two three of them are the rest i know but it'll be fun um but yeah so i'll move on to what is next i just went to um harry hartog the bookshop i just got two things I got this beautiful looking book called Book of Tarot. Like it is gorgeous. I saw this, I was like, it needs to be mine. Um, and then I just got the Rider Tarot deck to go with it. Um, there was a couple of other ones that I really liked. There was one called the Tattoo Tarot, um, which was like really nice. And there's another one called the Occult Tarot, which is um, like the artwork is really beautiful to me. It's like very dark, um, which I really like. Um, but I wanted to start with the traditional Rider Tarot. So, I have, I got both of those. And then finally, I went to my local spiritual shop. My local spiritual shop is um, Forest of Wisdom. And I just got two things from there as well. I got the Moonology working with the magic of the Lunar Cycles. Um, I've been wanting this for a while. I keep on seeing it. So it's definitely going to be one that I do start reading soon. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to finish the witchery, then read Pendulum, and then this one, and then look at um, Tarot. Um, but yeah, because I actually have the Moonology journal as well for next year, so I definitely want to get that as well. And then my other um, keychain. $13 just has a pentagram on it and some black beads um, so I thought these two together would go very nicely but yeah so that's everything I got I'm very happy with all my purchases um, I'm just going to try and figure out what some of the crystals are also put them on my altar um, yeah sort some shit out and I'm gonna go to Megan's house to puppy sit for the night. Thanks for watching. So I just got to my friend's house to puppy sit. This is Bailey. You've seen it before. <laughs> Hi Bailey. And she's too little to stay in the house by herself for the night. So I am gonna baby puppy sit for her. Um my dogs are okay at home. They have my mum. They also have two chihuahuas as well. So my world. And baby, baby, it's very excited. Yeah, we're gonna have girls now. Um, I would have loved to have my to sleep over as well, but the chihuahuas aren't dog friendly, so it's not the best idea to bring in a German Shepherd. But it would have been cute. What you only wish, but I am just getting um YouTube set up. And then I'm probably just gonna read for a while. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. You're so beautiful. Yeah, I love you so much. I love you. I love you. I love you so much. Yeah, I love you so much. I love you. <laughs>